Hey everybody, today is September 15th and it has been about 11 days since my last update on these plants. I have the here the, um, I, th I think this one, the mystery plant that I've been showing you guys and I think that's a chocolate maruga. I even labeled it but I'm not really sure. Uh, but it's already starting to fruit so we will find out soon. But anyway, let me. Sh I'll show you the fruit in a bit, and then the one in the back is the uh, Carolina Reaper. Then I have the orange habanero somewhere back there. So some people have been interested in the lights that I'm using, so I just thought I'd show it in this video. So the lights I'm using is from uh, Enviogro. And I got this on Amazon. It's a two by four tubes of T5. So that's what they look like right there. And I mentioned in, uh, in multiple occasions that the light is not very strong. So I have to constantly cut back my plants and so that you know the lights can penetrate through. And as you can see, the top is getting all the lights. The bottom, you see the dark part, so part there. So it's uh, it's not going all the way down. So some of the plants are sort of sort of like stretching some of these branches. But anyway, let me pull the plants out, and then I will show you what they look like today. All right. So here are what my plants look like today. Uh, I will show you the uh, mystery plants first. Uh, it's grown quite a bit and many it's gotten a lot taller than before so I constantly have to adjust the lights and the flowers are all over the place uh, I have started to hand pollinate this using a q-tip so I'm using the same one for most of all of these the flowers as well as the um, Carolina Reaper so my uh, I'm, I'm, what I'm trying to do is use the same Q-tip, that way I get the same pollen to try to cross-pollinate some of these to see what I can get out of these. But some of these have already started to fruit, so here is one of it. And I'm not quite sure what it is right now because the fruit is still small. So I'm hoping that when it gets larger, uh, someone can help me identify what this plant is. But it's looking really nice. It's uh, quite tall now. Um, very, very nice and bushy. Tons of flowers. And none of them have dropped off yet. So that's a good sign. So that's the top of the plant. This is the, the mystery plant. And then here is my Carolina Reaper. Very nice and bushy. And as you can see, the, uh, the, the branches at the bottom, they're a little bit stretchy because my lights are not very strong so it's it's like stretching out to try to get lights and and then some of the pl uh, smaller branches here they're not grown at all because it's been blocked but they are flowering right there they're just a few but there's mu much more flowers on all of these uh, other branches so there's there's tons of flowers it's just um, probably gonna take another week or two before they become fruit and then let me show you what I did to the orange habanero so that's the orange habanero um, I harvested all of the fruits already so I'll show you uh, at the end of the video in some pictures of what uh, I cut off and so on top of cutting off all of the fruits, I have also cut all of the darker leaves off. So I trim, I gave it another trimming and it started to grow back just like I did the last time. And again, it seems like I haven't done anything to the plant. I mean, it's just constantly growing and growing and growing. So the flowers are coming back now. So I'm going to get a, a second harvest along with the other ones. But um, everything's looking good. I might not have another update for a while because I'll be out of town for about a few weeks. So those are, here are my plants, all three of them. This is the, the mystery plants, orange habanero, and the Carolina Reaper. So let me show you again what the lights that I use look like. Um, so that's a two by four tubes, T5 that I ordered on, on Amazon. 
so that that's the bottom of the lights. And, uh, they're very small, not very strong, so I may want to upgrade these lights later on, but uh, for right now, I'll just leave it as they are. But anyway, I hope you guys liked the video. If you guys have any questions or comments, um, be sure to let me know. Alright, thanks, bye.